Here's what you missed on Fathead and Candy in the morning. Weekdays, 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1. His name is Mitchell Tenpenny. He will be in Mulcahy. He's on April 10th, and it's going to be a heck of a show, Candy. Guy's on fire. On really. fire! Fire! As you know, I have a sister, Amy, who's a big fan of the show. Yes. And no disrespect to any listener of the show, including my father, but my sister might be the biggest listener of this program, Candy. I love it. Yes. And uh, I asked her yesterday, I said, "What well, you know, because she's up in the uh, Albany area. Yes. And I said, are you getting that blizzard? She said, no, just rain. So, uh, and she's used to the big, the big dumpings of snow. Oh, you know? yes. When you live up there, you're used to it. Uh, Buffalo looks like, I mean, three to four feet. Did I read that correctly? Yeah, that's what I'm seeing. Yes. Yes. 50 to 60 mile an hour shot it. It's snowing. Oh, my God. 50 to 60 mile an hour winds and three to four feet of snow up in. I'm uh, glad we don't live there. Up in Buffalo. Um, you know, uh, this uh, coronavirus candy. Yes. Has got me. I don't know about you. But I am every day, every second, I'm reading articles. It's got me crazy. And I don't say this like, I'm not saying this to bring it up, to joke about it. This is obviously a serious thing. It's very serious. I take it very seriously. And you know, I'm a germaphobe, so that makes it even worse, right? I think you should cancel your flight to Las Vegas and well, stay home. You know, listen, this is one of the things. The, the Vegas trip to the ACMs. And uh, we're also looking at a cruise at some point. Um, it's I wouldn't sc- get on a cruise now if you paid me. It's a scary. I wouldn't take a cruise. Oh, no to the cruise. Scary no. situation. Mm-hmm. Um, and then I just read, and, I, and my sister and I, we send articles back and forth because she's just like me. She's, by the way, she has the N95 masks. That they oh, say are the good ones. Oh, yeah. She, she bought those, believe it or not, she bought those when SARS was out. Oh, because so, they're, you know, they're running out. You can't you, find them. You can't them. get them. I went on Amazon. And, you know, I got my nails done mm-hmm. last, uh, yesterday, and my nail girl is from South Korea. She mm-hmm. has family there, and they can't get, all the masks are gone. Of course. So she mailed her some, and her um, other co-worker is supposed to go to South Korea, and she canceled it. She's not going. It's very bad. It the is mother, really bad. the sisters, they're all staying inside. People aren't going out. They're not doing anything. It's terrible. I wake up to this article. Korean air flight attendant with coronavirus reportedly serviced a 400-seat aircraft that flew between South Korea and the United States twice. Oh, my goodness. I mean, you know, the, but that, see, now... This is just one example. I mean, this is we're we're what in like forty countries around the world now, and uh, you know maybe more. And I mean, this is just one example. You can't contain this thing, Candy. I I hate to uh, you know. I, I, it's I, very serious. I don't want to sound scary. the alarm, but it's serious. My girlfriend serious. works in the city every day, taking yeah. the subway. She's got masks mm. that she wears. She says a lot of people are doing the same. So my my buddy Josh went yesterday to Florida on a trip with his family or whatever, his parents or whatever was. Anyway, he was in the airport, and I asked him, I said, anyone sitting by the gate with a mask on? He goes, no. Anyone on the plane with a mask on? No. I'm like, wow, that's very, you know, that's shocking to me. It is shocking. Uh, So, yeah, you know, I don't know know what to say, but this Vegas thing has, uh, look, I mean, out of how many people, there's what, 300, 400 million people in America? And a lot. How, and how many people have uh, been confirmed maybe maybe have it or in, in containment? Uh, a couple hundred? I mean, if you do the percentages, you know, may, but how quickly does this explode, Candy? We That's the question. We don't know. That's the problem. Right. Will it... Uh, it's will not it, contained, that's no, for sure. It's not contained. And and how quickly does it uh, advance is the question. So these are things on my mind. I really don't know... Uh, well, I think you should go home right now. Mm. And I think you should stay home until this is all over with. <laughs> The people who've built bunkers in their backyard with canned food, not so crazy anymore, Candy. I never thought they were. Although, man, you need that bunker in your house. I don't know that you want to be outside, but... You... Yeah, uh, whatever it takes. Oh, my God. It. I'm going to the supermarket and just taking shopping carts of canned food right off the shelf. Oh, boy. I uh, No, but, it re- I'm, you know... It's a serious issue. I know. I think about... I It's terrible, but I think I mean, about Italy it all the time. I mean, Italy is getting... Forget it. Right. Swamped with the virus yes. all over Italy. I yes. mean, it's spreading. Yes. That's all there is to it. And then, of course, the financial impact because, you know, people stop buying stuff, stop uh, tourism, stop, yes. uh, you know. It's affecting everything. There's the a lot of. market, it's affecting everything. It's a, lot a terrible of things. thing. Good morning. Happy Thursday. Hey. 718. 
So much for morning shows being light and upbeat. Oh, yeah, yeah. I feel real good now. Fathead and Candy in the morning, weekdays 6 to 10 a.m. on My Country 96.1.